Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to all of my wonderful and juicy and delicious little subscribers. And how I love you all so, and I hope that you're all super duper wow, super duper wonderful and super duper delicious and that life is treating you oh so deliciously wherever you are. Sorry, oh, camera. Okay, now good morning, good afternoon, good evening to any passers by and I hope that you too are having a super duper and delicious time wherever you are in the world. So much love to you all as well, my delicious little baby. So what do we do? Three, two, one, be me up, sky. Oh. <laughs> I've just blown. Oh, there we are. <laughs> I've just tested my little lights before I come on the camera. Oh, hello, little lights. Lovely and bright. There we are. Right? Now then. Okay. So, the weather in our neck of the woods in the old UK, it may differ in other places, my delicious little baby as well. It has been really, really flipping super windy today. Okay? It is rather cold, so I would say that it's uh, colder, uh, you know, than... Um, I would say most Aprils, okay, uh, and it was raining, absolutely flipping, peeing it down, bucketing down, okay, so, you know, that's what we expect, isn't it, in the old UK parts of it anyway, so yes, yeah, so if you do enjoy my video today, if you could please click on the like, for others of you, if you'd like to um, subscribe, please feel free, and thank you to uh, all of my wonderful and beautiful new little subscribers because I've already got my wonderful and beautiful existing subscribers so thank you thank you thank you okay for even taking the time to subscribe to me and listen to my videos and thank you for any likes that I have received okay I do try to cover all different um topics do you understand what I mean and and uh, subjects okay now one of them being today is going to be I'm going to leave that till last actually so let me just uh, begin okay so the first thing I want to say to you so if you want to learn new things you know like how not to pay council tax and things like this okay <laughs> sorry my delicious little babies yes right well if that's uh, what you wish to do you know just so that you can have your sovereignty back and your freedom okay well uh, if you could please uh, go on to I mean I use my search engine which is uh, .go but for others of you delicious little babies, you may uh, decide to choose another search engine of your choice. But uh, if you could please tap in, okay, on one of your search engines, please and thank you. Sovereign Empowerment dot net. Okay, my delicious little baby. So I shall repeat that just once more. Sovereign Empowerment dot net. Okay, my delicious little babies, if you could just please bear with me, I'm having a bit of a hot flush. Just one moment, please. I've got to open the door. I'm sorry about that, my delicious little babies. You know what it is? I'm having a bit of a flipping hot flush, you know. <sighs> okay, so I've just had to uh, turn the heating down and uh, open the door. Okay, now normally I always like my, uh, my lounge door closed, but... <sighs> I just need to, do you know what I mean? So, and then, and then of course, you know, if I open the flipping window, well, it's going to be too flipping cold, so you cannot win, can you, anyway? So that's that, sovereignempowerment.net, okay? And then you can find out more information, you know, for those of you uh, wonderful and delicious little babies out there uh, in the older UK, okay? I mean, I'm not sure if it just covers all of the things. I need to have a proper look at it later, but I actually heard it on another video, okay? So, you know, for those of you who are interested in that then that's the place to go okay now then then I've heard uh, today that um, well in New York City they've unleashed uh, robot dogs you know robot dogs okay that doesn't mean no by the way I've got an itch okay um, so yeah and I mean these are quite large as well these are uh, robot dogs okay so, yeah, so that's what they're up to there. Okay, it seems that uh, they do not want um, what we would call... I mean, I, I do not like to call them little doggies. I like to call them our little babies, our little sons and daughters. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Yes, but uh, it seems that uh, they're not really wanting, you know, normal dogs, you know, that we would say they prefer robots. Okay, my delicious little babies. So, now anyway, so I thought I'd just tell you that. So, that's ticked off. Now then... Uh, there's another one actually if you could please just take just a quick little listen uh, this man he's on bit 
shoot b i t c h u t e okay bit shoot and what you're looking for is um you know what it would be is uh, info wars info wars okay and it's fed now so the title is fed now not fed as in you fed you, you know fed f e d fed now deep state trap okay what he does he's your man there's just explaining something just in in uh just over five minutes okay i'm a delicious baby so yes yeah. so it's you know of course you know i know about these things uh what's going on do you understand what i mean but for those of you delicious little babies who do not know because some of you will know but for other delicious little babies will not know uh then please you know that's also another one to go on now like i say i do not advertise all the time but sometimes i do okay now then, uh, something else I want to say. So uh, I'm sure that you've all heard of, uh, he's, uh, is he a monk or something like this, okay? And his name is uh, Dalai Lama. So, you know, D-A-L-A-I, Lama. So it's uh, L-A-M-A. -A. Uh, and he asks, I seen this the other day actually, my delicious babies, but I forgot to flip him right it down, didn't I? Right, so anyway, just uh, tick that one off. Um, well, it turns out, my delicious babies, that he stuck his tongue out and he wanted a little bairn, a little child, to suck his tongue. Yes, my delicious babies, okay? You should have seen your dirty man there, stuck his tongue guy for the little bear. What I want to know is, is where was the bloody parents to the little bear? Do you know what I mean? Because I know if it was me, my delicious little babies. Now, I'm not, an, I'm not a nasty woman and I do not class myself as violent, okay? But what I will say to you is, well, I'm not. But uh, what I will say to you is, well I, I, well, I mean, at the end of the day, you have your moments. If somebody's going to attack you, you're not just going to stand there. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? But my point is, in all of this, is that if that was me, your man there, I would flipping on the screws, flipping head. Do you know what I mean? And I think, no way. I feel no way about it, my delicious little babies. Do you know what I mean? Okay? I mean, that sort of thing carrying on like that. Dirty paedophile. Do you understand what I'm saying? Do you want to look at babies? It's disgusting. See how they're coming out into the daylight. Filthy, dirty creatures. And he is a filthy, dirty creature. Anyway, so I just thought I'd let you know that, but that's on bit shoot as well. I want to look at babies, okay? Disgusting, flipping individual. Anyway, needs a good flipping slap, is what he needed. Well, he needed more than a flipping slap. Like I said, I would have took the flipping head off him. Right, now then, um, now, finally, to do with all this, I don't know if any of you would have remembered this, my delicious little babies. For some of you, you would have remembered, but, you know, delicious little babies out there, but for other delicious little babies, you would not, okay? Well, there was a, a nurse, was it in America or Canada? Anyway, her name uh, is Tiffany Dover, Tiffany Dover, okay? Uh, now then. It turns out, my delicious little babies, because what happened was she was on the camera, okay, and she'd worked as a nurse uh, for years at this, um, well, you know, this place, this hospital place, yes. And anyway, and, uh, well, basically she'd taken the old uh, jab, 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 jibby jab, right? And I, and I am going to say, God bless anybody, you know, who has uh, very sadly taken this uh, experimental. Uh, well, the fact of the matter is, is that uh, she's, um, well, she's been resurrected. So when everybody thought that uh, she passed away, I mean, it does look like her, to be honest with you, right? But but the whole point in all of this, because I was looking at another video, right? Now, the whole point to all of this is for two years, she completely went off the radar, okay? So nobody heard from her, nobody. Do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? Um, but now all of a sudden she's reappeared, it seems. Okay, now, you know, as she explains, I'm just going to tick that off my delicious little babies. Now, as she was explaining, yes, she was explaining that, um, you know, well, you know, that ones out there thought that she passed away, you know, because what happened was she, um, she fainted on the camera, okay. Now, what she's saying now is, okay, 
is that uh, sometimes she does that. She has these fainting moments or something like that. But of course, when others out there were really worried, right? Well, it turns out all along, only according to the video and the bit of footage that I've seen, yes? Well, it turns out that she's flipping alive, isn't she? I mean, please do not get me wrong. I mean, that's a good thing, isn't it? But my point is, why go off the radar for two years? Do you still some saying she went to Lishuk Babies? To me, it just makes no sense. Do you, do you still some saying to you? That's just to me. Do you say? But now she just reappears. There's something rather flipping odd there. There we are, I would say. Do you still some saying to you? Yes. But she's, um, what she's done, she's a dad of hair. So she's, you know, dad it. So uh, she hasn't got that dark hair anymore. She's got like a kind of a lighter, it looks like uh, like highlights and things like that. But her eyes look the same. Do you see what I mean? So I would have said, I don't know. I would have said it is her. Yes. I would agree with the uploader here that, that it is her. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. But I mean, fancy doing that and ones are really worried about her. You know, and she just goes off for flipping two years. Do you know what I mean? Then reappears like it's flipping nothing. Do you see what I'm saying? Flipping crackers, if you ask me. Anyway. And, uh, right, finally. So I just thought I'd let you know that, my delicious little baby. So it seems that your woman there is alive. Okay. Now then, something else I want to discuss. Now, what it is. So I've saved this till last. Okay, my delicious little babies. Now, this is to do with wills. You know, wills. Writing a will. Now, I happened to be speaking to somebody yesterday, okay, you know, and, and you know, uh, she's, you know, they've clearly um, uh, asked me not to, you know, to mention, do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, so anyway, and I just said yes, I said that's not a problem, okay. And um, this is in the UK, so I'm not sure what it's like in uh, other parts of the uh, world, my delicious babies, okay. But um, now, hang on a minute. I've got to read my own writing because it's I, I just what it was. I was scribbling it all down, and with me, what happens is when I scribble it all down, what ends up happening is is that uh, well, it just looks a flipping mess. Okay, my delicious little babies. Yes. So uh, please bear with me, okay? Because I have to read my own writing. What's that say? It's me own writing, I can't even read me through their writing, I'll take the notice. Right, so very important to make a will. Okay, so this is, you know, right, husband and wife. Okay, so uh, one month ago, but the who told me, the dear who told me, yes, um, they said to me, well, you know, just double check it. Do you see what I'm saying? Yes. So this is only according to what I've been told, my delicious little babies. Yes. Only according to what I've been told. Now, right. So one month ago, if, say if a wife passes away. Okay. This is uh, everything I wrote down. So say if a wife passes away. Okay. Uh, husband. What's that say? I cannot read. I cannot read that, that word. What else did I say? Anyway, husband would receive everything. Yes, that's right. So how it used to be, my delicious little babies, is that if your husband, sorry, if your husband, say, if you, okay, if your husband or wife, let me just get this straight now, me old noddle, okay, just so I can explain it to you, my delicious little babies. If a husband or wife passed away, now usually, it means any assets, anything, yes, or house, whatever it is, right? However, it uh, rocks and rolls, yes, would then go to the husband or wife who's still alive, the surviving, yes, okay. Uh, but the latest lorries, my delicious little babies, okay. So the latest lorries, if one spouse passes, okay. Uh, some, what's that? 
some things, some things. I'm so sorry about this, but I just took my eyes. I should have, I should have read through it and, and wrote it out again, but I just didn't. Oh, not to worry. Okay, I do have my moments, but I just took my eyes. Right, some things will go to the husband or wife. Okay, my little stick babies, yes. Um, you know, who is living, okay? And some, yeah, and some to the bands, you know, the children. Do you understand what I mean? I call them bands, but they're children, and some will go to them, yes. But a chunk, my little stick babies, goes to the government. Did you hear that, my little stick babies, yes? So this is up until one month ago. So some will go to the surviving, whether it's a husband or a wife, okay? Some will go to the bands, the children, yes? But a large chunk of it uh, goes to the governments. Now, what the flipping effing hell is all that about? Do you know what I mean? If ones out there have worked all their lives, do you see what I'm saying, yes? It's like this flipping... Um, Poxy flipping uh, inheritance tax that they brought in some years ago. Do you know what I'm saying to you? Yes, and the tax in everything. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, anyway. So what this is saying is it mirrors each other. This is, I just wrote it down as who was, it was telling me. So it mirrors each other and it's individual wills, okay? Uh, then a draft read through and signed if you are happy do you see some signs so in other words you know it's like then it gets you know it, it's a draft yes and then if you're happy with that you know happy for the putrid government to take a large chunk well then you can sign it if you're happy to do so okay now here's something else the indian so i hope you you all got that when i was just saying to my delicious babies yes please and thank you Indian way of life now is, what's that? Oh, right, is really merging with the West. This is only what I was told, my delicious babies. So Indian way of life now is really merging with the West, okay? And of what? Oh, I don't know. I cannot read that last bit. My delicious little baby, that's me over the writing and I cannot even read it. Do you see what I mean? But you're going to get what I'm saying, yes? Oh, I know what this is about now. My delicious little baby, sorry, I've just had to, you know, it's just come to me now, yes? See, what it is, like, if you look at, you know, because I was talking about arranged marriages, yes? Okay? But now, what this is talking about is that uh, it, the Indian culture, yes? Well, the, the merge with the West. So, in other words, you know, like, say, years ago, oh, oh, oh yeah, party, right? Um, years ago, uh, where, you know, like... Well, it's an arranged marriage, isn't it? Which means that, you know, you either see whoever it is once or something like this, yes, and then, you know, and then this is what you do, yes? Well, now, it's it's sort of, it's completely different. So, like, you know, um, I mean, it's like me. I know some, um, you know, where you've got Indian uh, families, yes? And especially over these recent, um, I'd say, years, you know, over a decade or something like this, yes? Uh, well, well, even longer than that, actually where, um, you know, you can actually have where, say, if it's an Indian uh, man, then he can marry, if he wants to, he can marry a white woman or something like this or a, uh, or a black um, woman or, do you understand what I'm saying, or, or a, another Asian? Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, so it's more free. Now, I was also talking to this other man yesterday, actually, Right, a taxi driver, and he was telling me because he he comes from his country, the um, outside, um, it's like the border of Somalia, that's his original country, you know, where he comes from, yes. 
And he was explaining, because I was having a natter to him, yes, not in that way, my delicious baby's not in that way. And he was explaining that he um, chose his own girlfriend who he's with, yes, and she chose him. And what did he say? It was 100 years ago, right, where in his particular country, yes, that they actually uh, abolished, so they stopped, you know, where you was forced, do you see what I mean, to marry uh, from a young age, say like a young lass, you know, and I've done a couple of videos on to do with uh, this sort of flipping putrid carry on, yes. But um, th that's been stopped in his country, that's what he told me, and it was uh, about 100 years ago. Well, it was 100 years ago, he said. But, uh, and he said it's not allowed. So they're not allowed to, you know, young glasses, you know, or young little bairns are not allowed to, um, you know, uh, marry at that age, okay? Because it's illegal over there. Do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? Just let me have a sip of my coffee, please. And thank, thank, thank you. Yeah, so, uh, so he was explaining um, that to me. So, you know, it's just interesting to listen to others. And now you are actually having a lot of, say, um, Indian uh, men and they are marrying their uh, white, um, you know, wives. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, but actually I must be honest as well, you know, I mean, I mean, they do look after their wives. Do you sort some sign to you? Yes. You know, they're very, um, and especially if, uh, well, you know, the ones that I uh, know of as well. Yes, is it, um, well, they're very good to their wives. Do you sort some sign to my delicious little babies? Yes. You know, and they even do the housework, and you know, and if, if she's had a little baby, and do you sort of mean, so as well as doing their job, they look after their little wife and their little baby. Do you sort some sign to you? Yes. So that was, um, you know, so I was having a conversation as well about these sort of things yesterday as well. So, yes, yeah, so it seems that in some parts of the world, we have got this putrid situation continuing, uh, you know, which at the end of the day, it's not acceptable. Do you understand what I mean? But in other parts of the world, it's different. OK, so that's uh, what I'm getting across to you, my delicious little babies. Yes. So, and, and that's that really, and, and the way I see it is, I mean, it doesn't matter who you are, well, I, I do not mean it's that way, my delicious little babies, I'm just trying to, well, I'm not trying, I am explaining, uh, it doesn't matter what culture you are, do you understand what I mean? I believe, this is just my belief, my delicious little babies, others may see things differently, but that's the beauty of life, isn't it, you know, I'm just a woman with a view, okay, and I will have my view, right? That so I believe that it doesn't matter what culture we are, okay, if one loves another, okay, well, it doesn't matter where they come from, does it? You know, but I feel that it's very important, okay, um, you know, whether somebody wishes to be with their own um, culture or whether they choose a different culture. But as I've always believed, you cannot help who you fall in love with. Do you, do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, I mean, and I do not care what anybody says, you know, you have to be able. I mean, I feel sorry for these, um, you know, especially decades ago, you know, ago, where, you know, uh, they had this arranged marriage. And God bless the beautiful dear little souls. But on the photographs, and I've seen flipping many, let me tell you, my delicious little babies, and they just simply just do not look happy at all on their wedding day. Do you, do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? And that's even if they're a bit older. Do you see what I'm saying? They just do not look happy at all. Which, you know, to me, you've got to be able to... You cannot just see somebody once, like, which is what goes on in these sorts of marriages, right? And that's not being nasty. I'm just being done saying it. You cannot... How can you... You know what I mean? You have to get to know somebody. Do you sort of saying to you, yes? You can, cannot just say, oh, yeah, and that's that, and then the parents then just sort of bang you together. Do you understand what I'm saying to you, yes? Because nine times out of ten, it's not very often that you have happy marriages that way. It isn't. My daddy shook babies and I've known long time for decades. Do you sort of saying to you, yes? You, you get probably, what, 
out of 100 percent probably um i'd say 10 percent is where they're happy do you know what i mean where they they, they found that they loved one another but for, for most no but I believe that you should be together and you should be happy together and you should get to know one another. You, I mean, come on. Come on. I mean, you, there's got to be some sort of chemistry, hasn't there? Do you know what I mean? Instead of just being what I feel, just plonked with somebody. Do you see what I'm saying? She wants to be stuck by this. Because I know if it was me, there'd be flipping no chance. Do you, do you know what I'm saying to you? Yes, you know, you want to get to know somebody. You don't just want to flip and meet them once and then and then you get married off and then before you know it, oof. I mean, this is where it's very, do you understand? Sorry, delicious little babies, but that's just the way I see it. Do you understand me? I mean, you may not fantasy him. Do, do you see what I'm saying to you? You know, I, I mean, well, you know, there's, there's got to be a chemistry is what I'm saying. There's got to be something that you like about somebody else. But if you imagine, and in these poor arranged marriages, and then what, what are they doing? They're having to wake up every morning and look at his flipping mug. Do you see what I'm saying to you? I mean, I mean, ugh. I mean, just imagine. I mean, imagine if you never fancied them. Do you understand what I mean? It's like every time they come near you, it's like you're flipping skinned crawl. <laughs> Sorry what to look about this, but it's true, isn't it? Do you know what I'm saying? And of course, with these arranged marriages as well, which I know from decades ago, right? Uh, in certain cultures, yes? Uh, that, you know, it, it always seems to be where the man seems to have more of a choice than what the woman does. Do you know what I mean? Like, say he could, and, and, and this happens in, in a, where is it? Uh, with the Kurdish as well. And that's up until uh, years ago, you see? Um, where with the man he can choose out of three or four women and then if he still doesn't like them do you see what I'm saying to you yes but of course the parents said and of course they get to a certain age because I knew someone years ago my delicious little babies and how old was they 36 and he said oh he said my wife you know my mum and dad you know tried to marry him off do you understand what I'm saying yes in fact, you know, like, so he was meant to be going, travelling back home, you know, to go and see his mum and his dad and everything. Do you see what I mean? It, it actually put him off, you know. It's not that he never wanted to see his mum and dad and his brothers and sisters. No. What it was is that he didn't want to be continuously, you know, like GBH, the flipping hero, oh, when you're getting married, when you're getting married, you know, because 36 in Kurdish is classed as old, to, you know, to get married. Do you see what I mean? But as it turned out, this particular man, he, he wasn't... The way he explained it to me, my delicious little babies, yes, is that he what he said was he, he didn't like his own um, culture. Not that he didn't like his own culture. How he was explaining it to me is that he prefers to be with a white woman. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Rather than be with his own, you, you know. And of course, you know, his parents. And of course, you know, they say, oh, you know, they want him to be with the one who's been to university or something like that. But he, he never wanted that. Do, do you see what I'm saying to my little babies? Yes. But then so saying that in flipping Kurdistan, right? And this is no word of a lie, my delicious little babies, okay? And it still flipping goes on, you know, that uh, if a, 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 a man and a woman, you know, they're younger, with teenagers or anything, even if they're caught talking to each other, they can get stoned. Oh, yes, my delicious little babies. I saw it myself with my own eyes. Flipping wicked. What they do, do you understand what I mean? And that's just just for talking, you know. So really, when I look at you know me being uh, English, do you understand what I'm saying? I mean, heaven forbid. I mean, we wouldn't want to live in a world like that, you know, where you talk to a man and you end up getting flipping stoned. Do you understand what I'm saying? I don't mean stoned as in wacky backy puffy woofy. I don't mean that. I mean proper flipping rocks thrown at you is what I'm talking about, yes? And, of course, these sort of things go on in these different countries. So I'm not saying it's against any, you know, colour or, you know, nationality. No, I'm not. 
Okay, and anyway, anybody who knows me, they know I'm not flipping racist or prejudiced. Any, everybody knows that, yes? But I just uh, explain things to you, my delicious babies, about, you know, and different man and woman who I've spoken to over the years. Do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? And, you know, how their lives, you know, or their culture's different. Do you see what I'm saying to you? And I think it's really important to learn these things. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. But really, what it is that they want is like, what it really comes down to is like just more freedom. Do you see what I'm saying to you, my delicious little babies? Yes. It's just more freedom. You know, whereas like if you put in this situation, you know, they just want to be, uh, be able to marry who they want to marry, you know, and just not have all the grief. Do you understand what I mean? But like I said, for your man there, it even stopped him uh, travelling back to go and see his mum and dad. Because he just said, I just don't want to get married. To, do you understand what I'm saying to you? And you shouldn't have to feel that way, should you? Do you say? So, yeah, it's really interesting to hear about different cultures and what they do. Anyway, so that's the video, my delicious little baby. So, I hope that you got that. With the... <laughs> oh, gosh, my writing, honestly. But when you're rushing and you're writing things down, I've said it before, do you sort of mean? It's, I, I, it ends up where I just cannot even flipping read it myself. Anyway, so thank you uh, to any of you, my delicious little babies, for even taking the time to even uh, watch my video, okay? And if you, ha you know, if you do happen to enjoy the video, you know, if you could please click on the like, but please do not forget that if anybody is out there, my delicious little babies, or you know of anybody who is uh, wanting to make a will, well, it's to look into that, okay? To, to look into that, my delicious little babies, yes? And of course, please remember what I said at the beginning and thank you, sovereignempowerment.net. And that's to do with how you can get around, you know, not paying certain things. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. So, you know, it's all good stuff. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Yes, okay? Uh, so I'm not here just to, you know, to, um, you know, uh, be a little troublemaker. Do you understand what I mean? Or, you know, just turn everybody the, you know, the wrong way. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? But what it is, I'm just been getting it across. Oh, one last thing I've just got to say just before I go. Uh, for those of you out there, my del delicious little babies, if you know of anybody, okay, who's had been severely injured by this old jab, 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 jibby jab, okay? Uh, and it's on gov.uk. Uh, I'm sure in other countries it'll be on your local government um, web page, okay? Uh, well, there's only a short uh, window now, time frame, uh, to get your claim in if somebody's been severely injured from this, uh, you know, experimental, you know, there's not much time left to, uh, to claim. Okay, my delicious little baby, so um, I, I just thought I'd let you know that. And you want to go on to gov.uk, well, that's in the UK, um, vaccine damage payment, okay, you know, when you take a look. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious little babies? Yes. So I just thought I'd uh, just mention that as well to you all, my delicious little babies. So, yeah, so that's everything for today. There's nothing else on the close my book, okay? I'm like doing a video today, actually. Um, so yes, so I just thought I'd let you know, my delicious little babies, yes, and please continue to feel the love, okay? And please give a pat on the back, a shake of the old hand to some juicy and wonderful family members, friends or work colleagues. And please tell them that they're super duper, wonderful, juicy and delicious and that you love them so okay and please keep smiling and please take care of yourselves my delicious little babies and please also try and take care of others as well because there are going to be others out there who you know will need somebody else's help do you understand what i'm saying yes because really nobody can get by without somebody else can they do you understand what i mean okay so if you know that somebody's maybe not feeling well or you know what i mean or they, they need to talk about something you know there's many different ways that you can help somebody do you understand what i'm saying yes and please try and keep the vibration high. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? You know, we need to lift the old frequency, yes? But yes, you know, at the end of the day, I can only put out what I put out. So, are we having a party? Now the lights have gone off. 
Oh, there we are, back on again. Okay, <laughs> so until my next video, I'm out of hope. Look at this, though. I'm out of the babies. Okay, there we go, look. Um, so until my next video, sending you all so much love. Okay, God bless to you all. And I'm going to continue my party. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so until next time, God bless, and wherever you are in the world, you know, it's night time, you know, good night, God bless to you all, please do rest well, okay, but like I said, please keep smiling, okay, so you just take care, much love, thank you, God bless, bye-bye.